So to begin this straight to curly hair routine, I'm going to use an oil and um, comb my hair through just to make sure my hair is nice and detangled before I go into the shower. Then once I go in the shower, I'm going to make sure I rinse my hair thoroughly. After rinsing my hair thoroughly, I'm going to apply um, my shampoo. The shampoo I'll be using is the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strength and Restore Shampoo. I'm just going to make sure to lather that in and follow up with the conditioner. I'm going to use the OGX Nourishing Coconut Milk Conditioner and just make sure my hair is nice and finger detangled and saturated with the conditioner. Then I'm going to rinse that out. Then once I rinse that out, I'm going to apply the Curls Blueberry Bliss Reparative Hair Mask. I love this stuff, guys. Um, great deep conditioner. I'm going to put that all the way through my hair and then I'm going to follow up with an oil. I'm going to be using, of course, the Jamaican Black Castle oil. I love this oil, guys, as you know. And then I'm going to put my hair up and let it sit for 30 minutes. During this time, I'll usually just complete, finish washing up or shaving, whatever I need to do in the shower. And then I'll come back after 30 minutes or so and rinse my hair off with cool water to make sure that I lock in all the moisture. All right, so once I finish that, I'm going to style my hair. When styling my wash and goes, I like to make sure my hair is nice and saturated with water. The leave-in I'll be using is the Curls Blueberry Bliss Reparative Leave-In Conditioner. When I'm doing my wash and goes, I like to rake and smooth the product into my hair. Just constantly raking and smoothing the product in, as you see here. And once I finish applying the leave-in, I'm going to apply the Curl Control Jelly. Love this stuff also, guys. I'm just going to um, take smaller sections of my hair and work the um, product in. Doing the same break and smooth technique. Okay, once I finish doing that, I'm just going to scrunch my hair kind of to make sure my curls are nice and formed. And as you can see, guys, no heat damage. Yes, no heat damage from going back um, to my curly hair. And um, now what I'm just doing is just making sure um, any other extra frizzy sections, I'm just going back with the product and applying that again. But yeah, these are my finished results, guys. It's quick and simple way I go from straight to curly. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you next time.